Hello everybody, welcome back to Sin City Living. This is Jason bringing you today's episode. So today, obviously, we're going to be talking about a little bit of roulette. Haven't gotten any emails from anybody lately on uh, strategies, questions, video ideas, anything along those lines, so figured we'd show you guys a little bit of roulette. Do, do, some, roulette, uh, do some roulette stuff, came across a few strategies to use or to attempt. You know, dusty in here. And a little bit of a crack, that's not good. So, uh, alright, let's see what we got. Oh, a couple little cracks, it's definitely not good. Okay, so the first strategy that I have this for today's video, the strategy for today's video, is fairly interesting. It's, it's a basically focusing on one particular color. So what we're going to do, we're going to throw $18 right there on the red, which is interesting. And then we're going to throw a buck on every number that is black, except for two. Okay. Except for those two numbers. So this is a pretty interesting strategy. So let's, let's just kind of break it down real fast. So if any red number rolls, and there's Ignore the, the single zero, there's usually two zeros. Sometimes there's three, but there's usually two zeros here instead of, instead of one. So this has 37 combinations, but with both zeros you have 38 combinations. So red is 18 of those 38 combinations, so a little bit less than half, and it's gonna win $18. So what do we have out here? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. So if a red number rolls, we're gonna win $2, $2. So what about if a black number rolls? Well, we've got $16 here, plus we've got 18 over there. That is $34. So if a black number rolls, we're gonna win two bucks. We're gonna win two bucks, because you're gonna lose the 15 other ones that you, you uh, lost, but you're gonna win $35, so that's 20 bucks minus that 18 over there, two bucks. You're gonna win two bucks pretty much on everything except the 33, the 35, and the zeros. Two dollars if anything hits. So let's see how this goes. So again, we've got $34 set up out there. Let's, uh, let's give them another 34 just in case they have to set it up a second time. So they started out with Actually, we'll, we'll make it a little bit easier because uh, that would be $68. Let's have them start out with 100 bucks exactly. So they started out with $100 exactly. Let's see how things go. Let's go ahead and spin it out. All right. Haven't done, haven't spun roulette forever because this is definitely not my game. All right, so we've got a 21 right there, which means the player is going to win $2. Leave all, we're going to leave all the bets set up. I'm not going to sweep everything off every single time. Let's go for another spin. See what we get. Eighteen. So once again, the player wins $2. Here we go, one more time. Well, we're gonna do a few more times. Don't forget guys, if you guys are looking for an uh, online casino where you can practice your roulette or play some low stakes craps or slots, just check the links down below. Managed to find a pretty cool one. So this time, 36. So once again, we're gonna win $2. And go again. Hope everybody's excited for Super Bowl, though by the time this video posts, Super Bowl will have probably passed already. Hopefully you win your bets. All right, now we've got 12. So once again, $2. Ooh, that was a terrible spin, but it'll work. 
Again, I don't do roulette. That would be Amy's job. <laughs> Still wants me to learn this game, but I resist a lot. So, 18. Another $2. A whole bunch of reds so far. Five red numbers in a row. I have seen stranger things. Just looking up at the board sometimes when I'm working, looking up at the roulette board, I'll see say, the same number roll five times, something along those lines. So, 28. So once again, they make a $2 profit. So this would definitely be a grind. Now I'm, well, while I came across this strategy working with the dollars here, 32, another two dollars. Well, I came across the strategy working with the dollars. Obviously you could scale it up. Instead of winning two dollars at a time, you could uh, certainly scale up your bets, make these say five dollars per, per, uh, per number and uh, you know, scale up your, your bet on the red and win $10 at a time. Um, you know, or if you have a big enough bank, or I'll scale it up even higher, try and win $100 at a time. Because generally with any kind of roulette strategy, you, you only want to play it to win, you know, X number of times and then walk away. So number one, once again, $2. So, you know, a lot of strategies will say the ones that you win, you know, 25 bucks per, per, per hit, of uh, you know, win four times and then walk away because the the numbers always catch up to you. The numbers always catch up to you, so you don't generally want to grind away. There are a few grinder strategies out there. Woo! Almost lost on that one. All right, two bucks. Almost had a zero come out on that one. So you generally don't want to have you know don't want to try your strategy and just play for four hours kind of thing. You want to you want to have your walk away point. And usually it's just, you know, X number of hits, something along those lines. So you don't want to go too crazy with your strategies here. So we're going to give it uh, three more spins and then see how we did. So 28 once again. There we go. Another $2 win. So looking at this right now, they've, they've had 10 hits in a row. Pretty good. Pretty good. One more time. One more time. Oof, that was a terrible spin. Let me try that again. There we go. I think the next video I shoot on roulette, I might try and do a left-handed spin, see how that goes for me. And 11. Another $2 hit. So, they won 12 times in a row. That's a uh, that's not bad. Obviously, two dollars at a time would be a, a painful grind. But if you, uh, like I said, if you scale it up, scale it up to where, where you went, say twenty bucks a pop, they would have won two hundred and forty dollars. Two hundred forty dollars. Ten spins of the dice. Spins of the dice. Ten spins of the wheel. Two hundred forty bucks. Call it a day. Not too bad. So, hope you guys find this interesting, illuminating, enlightening, just plain fun, all the usual stuff. We will catch you guys next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye now.